got here to the Miami Boat Show a little bit early today so that I could give you a look around at the show. So this is what I'm going to be doing while I'm at the Miami Boat Show. Shooting a bunch of media, working here in the Evinrude booth, visiting my friends at Hell's Bay naturally, and doing a bunch of demo rides. We have the Hell's Bay Estero here with the 300 horsepower Evinrude e tech So I will be here for quite some time, but I'm gonna walk you around the Evinrude booth so you can see how nice this setup truly is. Plus, I'm going to stop and focus on a new 25 horsepower 15 inch shaft that I'm going to put on my little backcountry boat as soon as I get home. This is the little engine that could, that will be fashioned on the back of the transom of my new little 16-foot backcountry boat. Can't wait. It's demo ride time down on the Avenue Docks, Pier 1. So they tell me this multi-fuel engine, this MFV, that the Navy and a few DEA agents and stuff utilize will burn anything. I mean anything. Kerosene, gasoline, diesel fuel, av gas, probably even Papa's Pilar. In which case, I personally will get excellent fuel economy. So here's my ride today. Uh, Mr. John Biaggi was good enough to let us use his new Hell's Bay Estero that is powered by 300 E-Tech. And that's what I'm going to do demo rides on all day today. And I've got some media folks that are going to show up this morning. And we are going to take a ride around Miami and some of the uh, areas out in Biscayne Bay. And do a little something for Captains for Clean Water. And the support that Evinrude is giving Captains for Clean Water. So the guys from Wildlife Media just showed up. They're getting their camera gear ready. And while they showed up, I had a Flats Class fan show up and talk to me, and he literally had a tattoo of a Mirror Catch 2000 on his bicep. Now talk about influence. The huh. only thing could have been better is if it was me in the background casting that Catch 2000, huh? water today and we're shooting a lot of media for Evinrude for a new social media platform called wildlife.com. Yes sir, wildlife. And our eyes are replaced with wives. That's right. And this is Jason Rhodes. He, he commandeers or runs that, that platform. And we've been out shooting all kinds of stuff today talking about the sensitivity of the ecosystem here in Florida, talking about the brands that are supporting uh, the, the makeup of how we're going to fix our water problems. And some of those brands are Evan Rudy Tech and Hells Bay Boatworks. So we've been 
we've been out shooting media for them today. We've shot drone footage. And we talked about just about everything, but I learned a lot about about Jason's new platform, and I'm pretty excited that we're going to be able to collaborate with him and gain more eyeballs for Flats Class TV and for captains, and he's going to gain more eyeballs on our behalf as well. So, I encourage each and every one of you to, to look for wildlife.com and join, join their group. Start watching what they're doing. They're doing a lot of great stuff, and they're making donations to charities that benefit our environment. So let's see who's going to be in the Hell's Bay Boat Works booth. Fernandez, all-time great. Benny Blanco, great guy. I mean, unbelievable person. Andy Thompson, what a pro. Carl Ball, can I say this guy is fish for presidents? He's awesome. Rob Munoz, one of the young stars. Alonzo Saltillo, another young star. But this guy here? Who the heck is this guy? Joe Gonzalez? Anyone heard of him? Well, that concludes this episode of Captain CA on the Fly from the Miami Boat Show 2019. Hope you enjoyed all the footage and keep track of us on Instagram and Facebook. Until next time, Captain CA checking out.